<laughs> Do you remember Professor Dixon? Oh, uh, where is my attendance list? Well, where is that attendance list, people? <laughs> <laughs> I can't take my attendance without it. <laughs> Did you go to BU? Oh, no, I'm just participating. What's going on? Graham, this is my college roommate, Terry. He's in town for a couple days. Oh, hi, nice to meet you. Hey, dude, don't forget that the building inspector is coming tomorrow. Oh. This building has more code violations than the movie Wind Talkers. You know that movie about Navajo code talkers in World War II with Nicholas Cage? Hey, I Cage? gotta get to the hotel. Okay, great, buddy. Good to see you. I'll see you in a little bit, okay? Where is my attendance list? Oh. Wow. Well, he seems like a really nice gay man. What are you talking about? Uh, it's pretty obvious, Duke. Didn't you know? A few times back in school I thought he might be, but there was always a logical explanation. This isn't about deli meats! Oh! 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 There's your belt buckle! Oh, great! I thought we'd lost it. understand that last story. You were listening to music with your soundproof headphones and your RA walked in? Yeah, I don't know why I included that memory. If he was gay, why wouldn't he just tell me? Maybe he didn't know how to. You know, Duke, I... In the meantime, we've got to do something about this building inspection. I got it. We'll disguise ourselves as women. No. No, Duke. No way. No how, never gonna happen, absolutely not! See, if we did your idea, we would have looked sillier than those drunk trannies. That's my dad. Hey buddy, what are you doing? I only have a few minutes before the building inspector gets here, so I'm just trying to conceal these exposed wires. You know all about concealing things though, don't you? Like how you're gaining weight? Are you gaining weight and trying to hide it with bulky clothes? What? No. But you are a queer wolf. Are you a queer wolf? What's a queer wolf? Werewolf from Quebec. Look, Duke. If you're asking if I'm gay, the answer is yes. Why wouldn't you tell me? Well, I was afraid you'd get weird. <laughs> Look, friends aren't supposed to keep things from each other. Like how I'm hiding the problems with this building. I've got to be totally honest with the building inspector. I'm going to show him everything. I'm not sure that's such a great idea. I think we might have a gas leak in here. Okay, Candace. We've had some problems with the buzzer. That wasn't even the problem I was talking about. I put hidden cameras in every apartment, but they work great. I guess that's more of an ethical violation. We have rats, but I think if we keep overfeeding them, they'll eventually go away. Apartment 23 doesn't have running water, but the guy who lives there is a Nazi war criminal, so I think it balances out. I guess that's it. I should tell you right now, you're looking at about $500,000 in fines. And I should call the police. But I won't. <laughs> because of this man right here. I'll tell you, if Terry hadn't found my grandfather's lucky belt buckle all those years ago, I never would have gotten my life together to become a building inspector. Oh, it all worked out! Because we were all honest with each other. Speaking of which, there's something that you guys should know about me. Another uh, time, Graham. I think we've had enough secrets revealed for one day. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh.